Brandon in Hamilton, Canada writes, Hey Paul, I understand like all SACD transports and players, the PS Audio Transport has the Sony decoder DAC chip, but you don't use the DAC part, obviously. My question is, does this mean that all standalone SACD players do use the Sony DAC and not something of their own creation? Uh, no, that is not true. So, let's see, where do I start? How do I explain? All right, so. Here's our transport. This is the PS Audio SACD transport, and you know it has the, the drawer here that opens up. We use a really wonderful mechanism made by Denon and Marantz. It's the best in the world. I mean, those are beautiful transports. But all the electronics inside are designed by PS Audio. The, the actual mechanism that comes from Denon, from Marantz, and the uh, electronics that figures out how fast it spins and the laser pickup and all that that's that's all that all comes as part of the drive okay now if this were a CD player which it's not but if it were then we would have a DAC built in and yes you are correct 99.9% .9 of SACD players out there in the world Blu-rays SACD players they use the Sony decoding chip because, as we know from prior videos that I've, I've had, the SACDs are all encrypted and you need the decryption code to break that code and get the audio out because of piracy concerns. Sony does not want the actual DSD data to be available to an external DAC. Well, we allow that in any case through a special proprietary output, which is in the form of I squared S. And our transport knows if it's connected to an appropriate I squared S input, and then it allows that data, that DSD data to go through, and if it isn't, then it won't. And that's how we help Sony, yeah, it, which, and, and trust me, Sony could care less about us, okay? And to be honest, they could care less about SACD. I mean, that, that whole period is long gone in Sony's history. But that's how we do it. Yeah, so that's built in. That's all our own electronics. It's our own format. We came up with the idea of using an HDMI connector and came up with the formatting for the I squared S through that HDMI connector. And there are a number of companies, and we publicly uh, put it out there. We, yeah, I mean, here's the thing. What we're trying to do is make sure that nobody's pirating anything off of SACDs. You're just able to play it through your DAC. And a number of companies have taken up our protocols, which are publicly available, and we're happy to help out our brothers in the industry and our customers to do that. So, yep, that's that's all our own stuff. And no, we don't use the Sony SACD DAC stuff inside. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Bye.